All right, so we've got a good situation for leak detection. We've got an evaporator coil that we initially uh, pulled out of a job. It actually had a rub out leak here, uh, and then it was even leaking here. But after we got that all done, we've got it pressurized, and uh, we put just a little bit of Forte in, Forte a in it, about 50 PSI, and then we topped it off with nitrogen. And so we're doing a leak search with multiple different leak detectors. We've got a Testo, we've got a Inficon, we've got a Stratus, Inficon Stratus, which is you know widely considered to be one of the best in the market. And we've also got an H10 over here. So we're just going to go through and show all of the others, and then we're going to uh, show it with the AccuTrack, because this is one, the ultrasonic, that I initially didn't believe in, um, but I, I'm actually really impressed with the results. So I'll let you kind of hear what it sounds like. I don't know how well that will work, but we'll put the headphones over the camera. Uh, let's try some of these basic ones. All right, I'm all started off on high. Okay, so we're definitely picking up something right there in that corner. It's definitely, definitely picking up. And it's right down there in that in that corner. We'll spray bubbles on it so you can kind of see the cocooning here um, once we get done doing this. Let's see what Jessica has. Convincing. Cut it on check small. It, check it against the uh, check it against the leak reference just to prove that it's working. Right. Definitely working. So this is confirmed to be a pretty darn small leak. Here, let's adjust it. I put it on medium. Yeah, medium. We're not picking up much with the H10. Now hold on, did we, did we try it with the, did we try it with the uh, 316? I'm gonna try it with the Testo. You know, 316-3 is picking it up pretty. Okay, so that's pretty, pretty convincing. Yeah, this H10 is not doing great, and it is actually picking up with the calibrate reference, so that's a indication. There you go. So you can see it's definitely showing something. I was really impressed by how easy it was to find the leak with that. I mean, it really helped us pinpoint it pretty quickly. So now we're going to go ahead and just spray some bubbles on it and just show what that looks like. So if you watch right in that area, you're going to get some very, very fine kind of cocooning, some foaming there. And you have to watch it for a while to really see it. But it's a very small leak. It's right here where it meets the plate. And you'll see that foam just sort of builds right there. But again, we've, you know, confirmed that that is where the leak is with multiple leak detectors. The ultrasonic is really the winner as far as proving it, and uh, it's a very, very small leak. So it's, I'm, I'm convinced, honestly. And this is the AccuTrack Superior from Superior Signal. This is the case for it here. Thanks for watching our video. If you enjoyed it and got something out of it, if you wouldn't mind hitting the thumbs up button to like the video, subscribe to the channel and click the notifications bell to be notified when new videos come out. HVAC School is far more than a YouTube channel. You can find out more by going to HVACRschool.com, which is our website and hub for all of our content, including tech tips, videos, podcasts, and so much more. You can also subscribe to the podcast on any podcast app of your choosing. You can also join our Facebook group if you want to weigh in on the conversation yourself. Thanks again for watching.